Good morning. We are so happy that you're here. We daily vlog, so if you like this video, we hope you will return tomorrow. Yeah. And for the next couple of days, we should have regular vlogs out every single day. Um, so we got a lot of stuff done this morning. We are almost totally packed. Um, we are leaving once Peter is done with work to drive to Cleveland tonight. But until then, we're hanging out. Um, Violet actually does dance in our neck of the woods still. And so Christina, her and Luca, well like now Christina's taking her to class and we're, Luca's just hanging out here. Um, we have some visitors this morning, so it's nice that we got to see them before we go to kind of breathe after the chaos of yesterday and packing. And they bought us munchkins. little girl doing <laughs> you just relax oh yeah <laughs> we are nearing Jimmy's nap time we're hopeful that we're gonna get in the car like in less than an hour actually so I'm just crossing my fingers he's starting to rub his eyes starting to seem ready. We're going to change him out of his jammies to get fresh car clothes. He's pretty into his balancing game right now. We're going to feed everything out the window. That's the easiest way to avoid stairs. Peter's going to pull the car around. We're just getting the garbage out. We'll get on the road. Not too shabby, not too shabby. We have a bag for each destination. All right, it is 10 to four, and we are on the road. About to say goodbye to Chicago here in about five, five or six minutes when we pass the skyline. We're gonna see a couple of other big cities. Yes, we are. And let's hope she acts like this for the rest of the drive. Two hours later. It's been kind of a dreary drive so far. But look at this rainbow. You won't be able to see the top because I'm back here. Now here's the other half. We're, we are going into some storm clouds. But there's the other half. So cool. Jamesy is awake. He slept for like two hours. So our nap delay worked. We got Toy Story 2 on, eating pretzels. Look at Evie girl over there. The vlog is almost done, but I only have 4% battery, so I gotta get it plugged in. You need another pretzel? Just look how bright that is. That's like the brightest rainbow I've ever seen. We stopped at this really big welcome center. Go to the bathroom. I got a Popeyes. I don't think we're gonna have food. Sbarro. And, uh, oh, Starbucks was open. This is fancy. <laughs> That's so funny. You driving the car? <gasps> you got nutter butter all over your face. <laughs> <laughs> Is it funny that it's raining? Oh, don't turn that. That's the volume. Oh, you're washing the back window. <laughs> Here is a farther away view. Isn't that swanky? Jamesy, isn't it swanky? <laughs> Good news, we are in Ohio. We have probably 
just, just over two hours left to go. And in an hour, we're gonna order some pizza from Megan and Katie's favorite place in Cleveland. Well, it's actually in Lakewood. Um, if you didn't know, Megan and Katie Peaches, they're from Cleveland. And so is Chelsea. They both, they all, three of them went to the same college, Kent. Um, so that's really cool. So yeah, we're gonna grab their favorite pizza place tonight and then just bring it back to our Airbnb and eat it there. We are heading towards something very weird. Now that nightfall has happened. Like I've never, this looks like it's like refocusing a bunch. Yeah. That's how like the parking lots outside of Disney World look from the light pollution, but this is like super concentrated with weird clouds and a weird color creepy. in a very small area. It's kind of creepy. Okay, we are approaching our pizza place. Hold the pizza joint. Oh, okay. Jamesy's still awake. What I was gonna say was one time I wrote an essay and I'm somebody who likes to change up my vocabulary and not just say the same thing every time. Why are there hipsters everywhere? Because this is a hipster area. This There's is like a lot of people out. This is called Lakewood, Peter. And I used the word joint in my in my essay being like they went to a, a pizza joint. And my teacher was like, I really don't think you should use the word joint in your fourth grade essay. I disagree with that statement. How much, how many more minutes until we're there? 900 feet. <gasps> 800 feet. Well, hopefully it's the right one. I gave Peter the wrong address the first time. <laughs> Here we are, Angelo's Pizza. It is 10.30. So we're not gonna go in and eat, we're gonna bring it back to our Airbnb. Go! Alrighty, we have made it to our Airbnb. Evie, what do you think? What do you think? It's very cute. It is very like, just like has a lot of character to it. We got the kitchen here as you walk in. Little seating area, a little dining room. A little living room. This building is probably like four units. Yeah. Like. It's a unique shape. Yeah. And like a unique material. And then over here, we have our bedroom. And a bathroom. It's like strangely, strangely big. So this will be our home for two nights here in Cleveland. You still exploring, Evie? Lots to smell. So we got their deep dish pizza, Megan and Katie's suggestion. It's more of like a pan pizza, kind of Detroit-ish. And we got french fries, which are beer battered. And for dessert, can't get it open. And this is called Buckeye Pie, which is like peanut butter and chocolate. Ganache. Where would you like to go? You don't want to try the pizza, James? It looks like Jets, kind of. Mm -hmm. Looks really good, smells really good. Mm -hmm. How is it? Really good. I'm sure like eating it fresh at the restaurant would be even better. But really good. Yeah, James was kind of fighting food, but he was snacking a lot of the road trip, and yeah. then he I resisted. He was being goofy, he was resisting food, and then all of a sudden we gave him this, and this was his reaction. <laughs> <laughs> See, that is good. <laughs> right, we got a nighttime bed bottle, uh, and some frozen ever after plan. <laughs> Trying to calm down. Oh, I'm sorry. Olaf's frozen adventure. Wasn't a terrible drive at all. No. It's weird to do a whole trip in one go. <laughs> it just like or feels two so, or three days. so easy. The whole reason that we're in Cleveland is because of Chelsea's wedding shower, um, which is like, I don't know, like it's it's the it's what I get to be involved in. Yeah, you because because <laughs> Chelsea's ready for bed. Um, 
because I will not be able to stand up in their wedding because of the, how close everything is to Teddy's birth. Or go to the bachelor party. Right, because I won't be able to travel then. So this is like the big wedding shebang for Sarah. Right. And so I'm going to want to like help in any way I can, just be there. And um, yeah, so it's really special that it ended up being in Cleveland and not Florida because it was only a six hour drive and we all got to come. And now it's like weirdly on the way to North Carolina for right. my grandfather's services next week. Come here, come here, come here, come here, okay. come here. Come here. Come here. No? Ever since, ever since he learned that like backing off of things is the safest way, he just backs off of everything. Like, even if even it's the wrong way. The rug. <laughs> yeah. Even if it's not tall. Okay, well, he's going to disturb Evie, so... We're gonna go ahead and sign off now. Look at you! Look Jimsy, at you! Look at this crazy hair. Look at you! Jimsy, say, it's good to be home. It's good to be home. Say, I'm not gonna <laughs> fight us and sleep tonight. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.